hello friends welcome back and in this video i am going to show you remaining two methods to vertically and horizontally center your child element inside a parent element okay so let's delete all those properties that we have used in our previous video and start from scratch okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to delete all the properties related related to absolute position and the commented lines and also going to delete display table and position relative from this parent element now let's see what we get right now as you can see that we have our search form at the top left corner of our screen now we want to set it to the center of our screen okay so let's go ahead and we're gonna use a flexbox module for this purpose so we're gonna use a single property here which is display flex now let's go ahead and set the child element property to margin auto and the magic happens here just remove this margin auto property and see what we get right now you can see that nothing happens here okay so now go back and set the margin auto and let's hit refresh now you can see that our search form is in the center of our screen okay so this was very easy and just two lines of codes written for this purpose okay and now let's see another method just go ahead and delete delete this margin auto and set this parent element property justify content to center and also align items to center let me delete this align items and show you the result first you can see that this will only center the horizontally okay as you can see that this search form is centered horizontally only now we want to center it vertically we can go back and set its align items property to center okay so now you can see that our search form is again in the center of our screen or web page okay so to make these two properties work we must have to set the display property flex okay because these two properties are the part of flexbox module and this will work only if the display property of this parent element is set to flex okay and you can also set the flex flow property to row so now you have seen that two different methods to center your child element inside the parent container and we don't know the exact height and width of our parent element that's why we set their exact height or width to 100 percent okay so thank you for watching this video hope it helps you and please subscribe to my channel share this video and like this video if you really liked it and provide your feedback